Hello guys, thank you for choosing Handy Radio. Today we're going to compare three different antennas with the new Ocean KG UV8D. The first antenna on the left is the standard Ocean stock antenna and that's the, um, the UV dual band. The middle one is Nagoya NA771 SMA male connection. And the one on the right is Retech, R-E-T-E-C-H, that's Retech R-H-A 771. Now the Nagoya and the Retech are longer antennas. So as you can see from the screen here, it's about a time and a half the size of the stock antenna with the Retech being slightly longer, about half an inch longer than the Nagoya 771. This is a very simple test, just using the three antennas to check the receive since the uh, UV8D has um, a more meaningful S meter. So uh, let's read off to, um, from the screen how many bars does it return. M6 LHS Mike 6 Lima Hotel Sierra checking access to repeater. So we're getting about six bars uh, just over halfway on the stock antenna. On the radio now is the Nagoya NA771 SMA male antenna. Uh, you can see the, the writing is actually on the back. Now there's a slight issue uh, with the, the bottom, the base of the antenna. There's a small gap because the UV8D antenna does go in all the way, whereas the Nagoya is going to leave you a small gap there. So let's do the same transmission. So remember the last one was just over halfway. See if we get better reception with this Nagoya antenna. M6 LHS Mike 6 Lima Hotel Sierra checking access. Right, so on this one we're getting three quarters, um, definitely more than six. As you can see, the, the bars just right underneath the uh, 001 channel numbers. So, better reception, I'd say. This time we have the Retech RHA771, and again, it's a dual band antenna, but this one has a much better fit uh, fitting than the, um, the Nagoya771. And the quality of the antenna, it's slightly thicker as well. I mean, you do pay over twice the price for this Retech, um, but it looks nice. Let's see if it does improve the reception on the radio. So let's do the same transmission. We're on GB3AL. M6 LHS Mike 6 Lima Hotel Sierra checking access to GB3AL. Right, this one's definitely the best out of the three in terms of the S meter reading on the screen, and it gives me a, maybe another extra one or two, uh, one or two blocks over the Nagoya 771. So to summarize, the UV8D, a very good radio that works well with the stock antenna, but uh, it can be improved by using some of these longer ones if you don't mind the extra length. Uh, the NA771 will improve the reception on the radio, but the best out of the three is the Retech RHA771. That's the SMA male fitting, and it's a dual band 144 and 430. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.